Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. My name is Nuh Dekin and today I'll be reciting Surah Muhammad. A is one to three. أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الذين كفروا وصدوا عن سبيل الله أضل أعمالهم والذين آمنوا وعملوا الصالحات وآمنوا بما نزل على محمد وآمنوا بما نزل على محمد وهو الحق من ربهم كثر عنهم كثر عنهم سيئاتهم وأصلح بالهم ذلك بأن الذين كفروا تَبَعُوا الْبَاطِلَ وَأَنَّ الَّذِينَ آمَنُوا اتَّبَعُوا الْحَقَّ مِنْ رَبِّهِمْ كَذَلِكَ يَضْرِبُ اللَّهُ لِلنَّاسِ أَمْثَالَهُمْ السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته إن شاء الله today we are going to reflect on these three beautiful ayat of Surah Muhammad Surah Muhammad is a surah that actually has another name which is Surah Al-Qital the Surah of Fighting, which is to indicate that it is very relevant to the people that are in this fight for justice, trying to uphold justice. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala beautifully gives us three points of comfort for the person who is in this fight for justice. The first point Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala highlights in the first ayah, that the people who are being unjust, the people who are blocking people from the way of Allah, from the way of goodness, that inshallah Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will indeed bring justice to them and all of their good actions, if any, will be rendered null. Then Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala goes to the second ayah to give us another point of comfort that those believers that believe in this way of Islam, they believe in the Rasulullah wasallam, and they work good actions that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will relieve them, relieve them of their wrong actions and وَأَصْلَحَ and rectify their condition. أَلَا إِنَّ النَّصْرَ اللَّهِ قَرِيبٌ The help of Allah is close, my brothers and sisters. We have to believe that. And then Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in the third ayah gives us another point of comfort in which he highlights that the people who are following this way of injustice, their foundation is batil, it's empty, it's nothing. And you know what that tells us? Don't be deceived by the moving about of the people who disbelieve. Don't be deceived by the luxury they have, the comfort they have. Don't be deceived by it. Why? Because what they have is not truly bringing them what they're looking for. And what we have of La ilaha illallah Muhammad Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam is indeed what every human being is looking for, which is that peace of heart, which is that sakina, which is that indeed the true success in which Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will give us fid dunya wal akhirah, and we believe that. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.